UFC flyweight division title. So here he is, the number one flyweight contender, looking to change that title here in 25 minutes or fewer and lead as the undisputed UFC flyweight champion of the world. What a run to contention it has been for this young man. He has put together a long winning streak. He's got the finishes to make the fans happy. He's done everything to position himself for this type of championship opportunity. Now, under the lights, we'll see what he can do with. So here we go with this UFC Flyweight Championship fight, and there is the man out of the red corner, the reigning defending, undisputed UFC Flyweight Champion, making his way to the octagon. He's defended this belt before. This is not new territory for this young man who believes that the rest are just the rest. He believes he is the best at 125 pounds and looking to prove just that here tonight. Tail the tape for this flyweight championship fight. Three years apart with similar height and reach. Now for the official introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Our rounds for the undisputed UFC Flyweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 22 wins, 12 losses. He stands 5 feet 3 inches tall, weighing in at 125 pounds. Fighting out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, USA. Presenting the challenger, John the Magician Dotson. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 20 wins, one loss, and one draw. He stands five feet five inches tall, weighing in at 125 pounds. Fighting out of Suara Para, Brazil, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC flyweight champion of the world. All right, this is for the championship. You've been giving your instruction in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. They touch him up, and we are underway. Ready. is palpable as this fight gets underway and it's going to be interesting to see how this matchup plays out. Definite striker on one side against another guy who can really do it all. And in those situations, normally the guy that's more well-rounded will be the one that will find success. I want to see how this plays out. Oh, that's a beautiful kick right there. I don't know if you've ever been kicked by a mule. Probably feel something like that. You have to. This guy has landed his kick with so much force. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. 
Man, he's just got a great feel for the striking realm early in this one. The timing is on point. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up. Big punch man over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Just out of range with that right hook. Lands a big right hand over. Oh! The jab followed by the right hand. Just out of range with the big right hand. Boom! Big jab. So one minute into this fight, and as many people expected, the action absolutely crazy. Back and forth. This is a full-on brawl, DC. It's hard to watch a fight like this and call a fight like this because you never know when somebody's going to take that one shot that finishes the fight. Caught the kick. Well, that one should leave a mark. Outstanding leg kick employed there by Dodson. Great punch landing with so much power. Got clip with the right hand. Circling away towards the left net. Oh, now he stuns him beautifully with the left hand. The left hand is so accurate, so educated, he's so able to fight for both fighting standards. And he landed the right hand there. So just over 20 total strikes. And now landed for John Dodson. Oh, nice right hand, John. Man, striking class is in session. Beautiful punch there. Great job landing. What a damaging punch. That kick blocked by John Dodson. Oh, nice right hand. Oh, misses with the jab. That punch, no good. Dodson's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Great punch. Punch is blocked. Beautiful leg kick throw. Ooh. Now connects with a right. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Straight left counter is true. He comes forward with a flying knee that just missed hitting the target flush. Well, not much of a setup there. Misses with the left hook. Timing his shots nicely here, champ. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up and using a lot of diverse strikes. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Big ball punch lands. Now we get back to range. Oh, huge right hand! Beautiful movement, hip work on the ground here, just outstanding with the transition. He is not staying in one place on the ground, and that's very important. All right, he's got side control here, DC. You know, he's got a lot of different submissions in his arsenal once this fight gets to the ground. Big punch to the bottom. Oh, and now an elbow up top by Dodson. I mean, he's cutting him down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, tags him with the left. That is an educated left hand. Educated left hand. He's throwing so fast, so crisp. Good jab. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Oh, left hook to the head. It's blocked. Punch over the top. Oh, he got everything behind that kick. Oh! He's a strong five minutes down. So there is the horn at times in that previous round. I didn't think we'd get here after that head kick nearly had him out of there. It was a good round leading up to that. But when you take a head kick like that, 
When your opponent gets your entire body into that kick, usually the night's over. Very tough to still be standing, but he can't take many more like that. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, round two. Dodson's head kick is blocked, so no damage inflicted there. Oh, and he lands another strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Nice straight punch. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. The right hand just misses. Blocks the shot. And a miss with the right hook. Oh, vicious kick to the outside of that lead leg. You gotta start checking these, man. You gotta check these kicks, or you're gonna be limping around the octagon very short. Check yourself before you wreck yourself. Check it, check it, check it. All right, so a knockdown for him in the previous round, and you can just see by his body language how confident he is in the striking realm in this matchup. And you can see his confidence in his posture, but also you can see the effect the knockdown had on his opponent by the way he is approaching. Beautiful punch. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting the combination. I mean, hey. if you're gonna sit there at the drive -thru. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish his fight. Oh, he might be out. gets touched by that kick there. Well, no questioning the output thus far. 88 total strikes have now landed for Davison Figueredo and landing with 31% accuracy tonight against John Dodson. Oh, nice, nice. Get the hands going here early. Let's get going. Oh, you can hear the thwack from here as he lands it. Oh, wow! Maybe so have we, your winner by TKO. That was a great performance. Way to land those strikes and go and chase down the finish when you get an opportunity. Right, let's take a look back at the replay. It ends up a knockout, but this was really a striking clinic from the moment they touched it. I mean, a competitive fight. That one guy finally found the shot that ended the fight. But both of these warriors displayed a ton of heart. One guy got the finish, but neither guy should be disappointed in their performance. The official decision is in. Here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest. At two minutes, 27 seconds of round number two. Declare the winner by knockout and stand. flyweight champion. He is the best 125-pounder in the world, and tonight there seemed to be a pretty wide margin between number one and number two. Yeah, but number one, I mean, he is turning these challenges away like flies. He's a great fighter, man. He's hard to deal with. He does 